Today, Washington Governor Jay Inslee met with researchers at WSU's new cannabis research program. Krem 2's Shannon Mowdy traveled to Pullman, where Inslee heard a pitch for how a growing industry could be the answer to cleaner, safer living. Governor Jay Inslee was in Pullman to learn how hemp could play a big role in addressing Washington's housing crisis. Well, what are we looking at here? Governor Inslee got a first look at what could become building blocks to the future of green living, fiber hemp. Advocates like Ashley Stallworth. And we can get that thermal barrier, right, for the house frame up in a matter of days, right? Not weeks, but days. Say right? it could be the answer to problems plaguing Washington homes. Uh, when it comes to mold, uh, water damage, as well as the shortage on houses, right? Stallworth says it can be made into flooring, plaster, even walls, and is even fireproof. Researchers believe fiber hemp could take over as a top building material, replacing plastic or cement. Uh, this is a non-toxic material, right? A lot of those materials that you just listed give off VOCs or, or volatile type of materials that literally can hurt humans. Friday's pitch to Governor Inslee from Snohomish-based Biofiber Industries and staff with WSU's Cannabis Policy Research and Outreach Program. Washington should invest in this growing industry. It used to sound like something that was a very hippy-dippy, right? Like people didn't really think that, hey, this would be a thing. Professor David Gang says the technology's already there. Right, exactly. Yeah, four years ago, there was like one processor in the whole United States for fiber hemp. Um, that was just established, getting themselves up and running. Uh, right now, there's about 20 around the country. None of them are here in our state. Gang says Washington is actually an optimal growing location. I think there's a lot of growers who are interested. In and could become the nation's leader in fiber hemp within a few years. These can be something that we can get started in the next two to three years, literally have, have homes built and have people in them. With. Inslee's support. We ought to be willing to take a lot more risk in the developments of this industry and every other clean energy industry than we were in the new type of consumer product because we have to solve this problem. So we as a state ought to be willing to take more risks for new technologies and new products. Mm -hmm. This amongst them. That's how I look at this. Shannon Mowdy, Krem 2 News.